Creators of Chinese film and television have gathered in Los Angeles to celebrate the most successful productions of the year. It's an absolute honor to be here on the 18th year of this festival, and we are surrounded by so much talent. And our hope is to be represented in more places, even outside of the United States. Some industry leaders in Hollywood say they're noticing a positive trend in Chinese filmmaking. What I have basically seen in the past three, four years is Chinese movies have gotten just better and better. And I think there is more of an international feeling to not just make movies for China alone, but to do it in a way whereby it can travel for the rest of the world. And I've seen that very strongly noticeable. The festival will continue for three weeks, featuring nearly 400 films and TV shows in several theaters across Los Angeles, and many are pushing a social cause. The number of hate crimes against Asians has reached a record high during the coronavirus pandemic, and it's become a major concern for the Asian American community. This year, for the first time, Chinese American Film Festival has put this issue under the spotlight in hopes of raising more awareness about the issue. The director of the festival believes that films will bring about a social change. This year, we add a new uh, theme, which is use the power of the film to fight uh, hate crimes against the AAPI. So I think this year we will, we will use the charm of the film to bring the peace and harmony back to the community. Attending the gala as a guest of honor, Chinese Consul General Zhang Ping says the film industry could play a critical role for cultural exchange between China and the U.S. You'll notice that uh, uh, the Chinese uh, film industry has witnessed a uh, very big development recent years. I think uh, that somehow has, contrib has, has attributed to the cooperation exchanges with Hollywood. And many artists in this room are part of that cooperation and looking out for more co-productions between the two nations. It is Tian Shan, CGTN, Los Angeles.